Hi, welcome to Dinner with Alina. Today I'll be adding some last-minute touches to our traditional New Year dinner table. I will show you how to make three easy and simple Russian bruschettas or open sandwiches. First one is called sandwich with sprats and it requires a bit of preparation. Slice some white bread. I'm using Hungarian bread called Nagy Kifli. It's closest to white bread we have back home and toast it a bit. We need it to be crusty and crispy on the outside, but still soft on the inside. While my bread is toasting, I will make the topping. First, cut thinly or grate or squeeze one or two cloves of garlic and then mix it well with mayo. Cut a fresh cucumber into thin slices. We need as many slices as we have toasts. And then we also need a can of spreads in oil. This is typical canned fish we eat in Russia. Once your toasts are cooled, spread garlic mayo on top. And put one cucumber slice and then two fish pieces on top. And our first bruschetta is ready. Next is salmon bruschetta, which is super easy. For salmon sandwich, we usually buy salmon from the shop. It's the simplest solution. But we also like to brine it at home, and that's what I did too. First, I'm going to make my brine. Sugar. Salt. Ground white pepper. Lemon juice and olive oil. Mix it well. I have one defrosted salmon steak of about 200 grams. We need to peel the skin off to be able to brine it on both sides. Once done, rub the brine on both sides of the steak and put the rest on top of it as well. Leave the salmon in the room temperature for about 6 hours and then leave it overnight in the fridge. Next morning your salmon is ready. And after that it gets really easy. I'm gonna slice the salmon. Okay, that's the hard bit. And we also have bread from earlier. We just need to put butter on top and then a slice of salmon. Of course, there are ways to make it look beautiful, but no matter how it looks, rustic or sophisticated, it tastes great, with salmon cured and lemon and oil brine. And the third bruschetta is the easiest and requires least preparation. Unless you decide to buy raw caviar and brine it yourself, of course. Just buy a can of salmon caviar this is currently the most common we eat. Spread some butter on top of a bread slice, add a couple of teaspoons of caviar on top and then you're ready to go. Alternatively, you can make small caviar tartlets or caviar stuffed egg, but I prefer it this way. Simple and tasty. Now 
now you're fully equipped to celebrate New Year like a Russian. Feel free to check my other New Year dinner videos. Happy New Year! As a typical Russian, I'm going to take some downtime in January, and hopefully we'll be back in February with more Russian recipes for you. From Russia with food, Alina.